beginning of this past round, uh, round six. Right, it was a, you know, a down year for, uh, for Puerto Rico overall, so uh, you know, I think that uh, that has a lot to do with it. Like I said, it, you know, the, the hurricane had to have had an impact in terms of being able to play to be seen. Obviously, there were events all over the place, but it was just not that strong of a year. Uh, you know, so I'm going to effort to, to find a little more information on, on what more brings to with Puerto Rico Baseball Academy, of course, uh, you know, does some things, you know, that, that they bring out players each and every year in the draft. Uh, I feel like uh, every year the, the academy has been good at having draftable players, even if they haven't been the high-end guys. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you'll see some more names, I'm sure, pop up wow. right now. Run through round 11 40 tomorrow. We'll be live all day on MLB.com. Philly Select ID number 2254, Cotto. Gabriel Cotto, the left hand pitcher from the Puerto Rico Baseball Academy, hometown speaker, Puerto Rico. Philly. Gabriel Hato, left handed pitcher from the Puerto Rico Baseball Academy. Did you see that? I told you we would have another player from Puerto Rico. You told me. <laughs> the name is Gabriel Hato. I'm also curious, even if you're chatting someone like that there, and that's some two players neck and neck. How often it happens. We have so many rounds in the MLB draft, but lists are made, they're pre-made, so teams are ready to go with these picks, especially, especially tomorrow, we'll see, uh, 11 through 40. They, it's, it's a lightning round, they're ready to go with this. It's this huge list that is compiled throughout the year by organizations, but I wonder if you ever get to the top of your list, and the teams take them right oh, that before happens. you. That happens all the time. Yeah. Yeah. I even heard that we, uh, we, we had Taren Bopper going in the third round, huh? that he might have gone with a kick or two right after that. It happens all the time. That is crazy. You got to be sitting so frustrated in the draft. Jacoby Ellsbury was another one. When the Red Sox drafted him, I think the Astros were literally right behind him, ready to get Jacoby Ellsbury. Didn't happen. Wow. All right, let's go to uh, the Chicago White Sox. Uh, 